Hello everybody and welcome to this week's update. Today I am in our fantastic library. You'll be aware that we moved the library at the start of this academic year um, to help it be more accessible at breaks and lunch times and it is looking absolutely fantastic and lots of our students lose the library at breaks and lunch times. Now I'm just going to come over here and stick the camera down because I've got Miss T uh, with me today who's going to talk to us uh, about something that we've got coming up this week. But welcome to week 11, week 12, week 13, next two weeks, and the last two weeks of this academic term. Uh, Mitty, do you want to introduce yourself and uh, tell us what we're ha what's happening next week? Uh, yes, hello, um, Miss T, Assistant Vice Principal. Uh, I just want to talk to you today about a couple of events that we've got coming up. Um, first one next Thursday at the 21st, 4 to 630 it is our Year 9 Progress Review Evening. Uh, all Year 9 families will have had communication via the MCAS app um, to with the link to book your appointments on that system. And um, Please don't worry if you are struggling to access that and you would like to attend our Year 9 Progress Evening. Um, just give us a call at reception and we can book those appointments in for you. Also, if you feel that you maybe need some extra support on that Progress Review, review, review Evening, um, if that's you, know, you need interpreter or you know support from the EL, department please also give us a call um also next week at our progress review, review evening we are going to be represented by our parent ambassadors uh, joe and jennifer uh, we really uh, want to hear how we could improve our parents evenings in particular or our progress review evenings um so please if you are attending our progress review evening go and speak to joe and jennifer and give your feedback um i also just want to mention as well over the next couple of weeks as we are coming to the end of our cycle too we've got our fantastic recognition events coming up um, we've got our recognition afternoon next Wednesday where students that um, are eligible to attend that recognition event will be doing things like climbing diamond art bingo lots of really fun activities and then the week after please keep an eye on the post because our invitations for our recognition evening uh, will be coming out to families that are eligible to attend our recognition evening and then of course we've got our attendance recognition also happening in the final week of term. You should have already received a letter about that. Um, all of the students, over 95% of the attendants, um, are, are going out to the cinema. Uh, so please do look out for that. And we've also got, the week after, my favourite uh, recognition event, Platinum Party, haven't we missed? Platinum Party, yep. So the students eligible for that are the top 10% of every year group for the recognition points. Again, something you can track via the MCAS app. Um, so if you are not on our My Child at School system yet, it is available to everybody via an app and you can see your child's progress um, daily with what recognition points they have got. Um, please just get in touch with our reception if you are not aware of how to get on that app. But our Platinum Party is a fantastic event for the top 10% of every year group. So loads and loads of recognition going on over the next two weeks. And our students really deserve it. They've been working incredibly hard this term. So we're really looking forward to those events and, and sharing some of that excellent feedback with you um, in those coming events. So this week, I just want to talk about one highlight that we've had this week. Um, we had a year 10 visit to Lloyds Bank as part of our careers programme. And that's a really nice segue into what's happening next week, which is our careers week. Now, Miss Smith, who's another of our senior leaders, um, has been working incredibly hard to, to cultivate relationships and, and external partners over, over a number of years. And that means that we've got a range of people coming in next week to help them, uh, help the students inform their next steps of education and employment, um, a wide range of people. Last cycle of the Careers Week was absolutely fantastic. So we're really, really looking forward to it. And um, uh, there's a post on Facebook kind of highlighting some of the things that we're going to be doing, but do look out as there'll be updates all throughout next week. And um, the Facebook page is the best forum for you to get those regular updates. Um, we post them there regularly and we get a great engagement from you. So thank you for that. But if you don't already, please do drop a like on that Facebook page. Um, we've already mentioned recognition events and there will be some drop downs to support that. But, but I think the number of students this time, both on the attendance and on the recognition events has just increased exponentially. And I think that's a really good artifact um, of our improvement journey. So thank you for your support because this only works and, it, and we only get great outcomes for our students if we have everybody all working together. And that three-way partnership between the family, the academy and the child is so, so important. I just want to drop an early reminder to you that the 28th of March, which is a Thursday, is our final day of term. So that's um, a week on Thursday. Now, we will as normal we'll be finishing at 12.20. So you may need to adjust pick up times um, to be able to facilitate that. In next week's update, I'll remind you again. And of course, there will be text reminders. Next week is a big update because I'll also be talking about our uniform 
and school day consultation. And I'll be sharing that with you um, in that update. So make sure you're looking out for that. Um, lots of people have been reaching out for when those updates are going to come. So I can say absolutely for certain that is next week that we'll be talking about it. Um, th that's it from me this weekend. Anything further from you, Miss? No. Great no. to have you with us. I'll try and get somebody else onto the update this week. I know lots of people reached out to say they enjoyed having Mr. Byrne on last week, and I'm sure they'll um, same for Miss T this week. Um, have a great weekend, everybody. See you all soon, and look forward to seeing you next week's update.